welcome back. We have a lot to cover in this one, so grab a cup of tea or coffee to keep you going and let's get started. With Timely, you have many options available for staying in touch with your clients. Are you looking to send a reminder message before their appointment? Or perhaps you want to automate detailed aftercare messages. Maybe you'd like to request Google reviews or reconnect with clients who haven't rebooked yet. Whatever it may be, we've got you covered. For all messaging options in Timely, you have the flexibility to choose between sending SMS, emails, or both. Emails are included in your plan at no extra cost, but please note that there are a specific allocation of SMS credits included in your plan per month, which you can check under the billing section of your account. In this course, we'll cover everything you need to know about SMS settings, customer reminders, two-way messaging, did not show messages, booking changes, and penciled in messages. Let's start with SMS settings. Head to the setup and SMS settings section. You'll notice that two-way messages is already enabled by default. And we recommend keeping this option selected so your clients can easily reply to the messages you send them. Next, you can choose whether or not to allow clients to confirm penciled in appointments when they receive a reminder. By enabling this feature, clients will simply reply with a Y to confirm their appointment. And you'll see a visual update on the calendar for confirmed appointments. This is one of my favorite features as you can quickly identify appointments that haven't been confirmed and follow up with clients if needed. When you select the two-way messaging option, you'll notice two other options appear. The first one is make penciled in the default status for new appointments. We suggest selecting this option as only appointments that are in penciled in status can be confirmed by clients. The second option is send a confirmation SMS when customers use two-way confirmation. This is a great way to let clients know that their appointment has been confirmed once they've replied with a Y. Just keep in mind that it will come out of your SMS allocation. The following options are SMS time restrictions and SMS and email delay. SMS time restrictions allow you to set a specific window of time during which you can message clients. If you try to message them outside of these hours, the message will stay in the messages tab as pending until the following morning. SMS and email delay is another useful feature that we recommend setting to 10 minutes. This will prevent clients from receiving multiple notifications if you need to make several changes to their appointments within a short period of time. Once you've clicked on save, let's go to the setup and customer messages section. You will see that some customer messages have already been automatically set up when you activated your account. Let's start by looking at how to edit the existing SMS customer reminder. This is a great message to send to clients ahead of their appointments so they're less likely to forget to turn up. Click edit and choose where you'd like the reminder to be sent from the dropdown. You can customize the text in your Your Message field and personalize the message using the placeholders on the left of the screen. As you edit, you'll see a preview of your message. And if you've enabled two-way confirmation, you'll see a special preview for that too. You can also choose to send a consult form with your reminders, which will be sent to each client every time they have an appointment. However, if you want to be more specific about which forms you send, be sure to check out our consult course. Once you're happy with the changes to the SMS customer reminder, click on save and repeat the same process for the email customer reminder. We recommend setting the email message to go out at a different time than the SMS reminder to give your clients two opportunities to confirm or cancel their appointment and provide you with more time to fill it. Let's return to the customer messages screen where I'll demonstrate some helpful customer messages that you can create, such as booking changes, penciled in appointments, and did not show messages. The booking changes message is a notification that can be sent out to clients when a booking is confirmed, amended, or canceled. Head to Setup, followed by Customer Messages. Then click on Add a new message in the top right-hand corner and select the Booking Changes option from the list. You can choose to send an SMS or email notification, but you'll just need to set them up separately. When setting up an SMS, you can customize your message templates from confirmed, amended, canceled, and declined bookings, and use placeholder tags to insert dynamic content. 
When you're finished, click Save. If you're setting up an email, you won't be able to customize the template, so simply click Save. It's important to keep in mind that if you haven't set up a message for booking changes, your clients won't receive any confirmation message if you manually make a booking in the calendar, unless you have penciled in messages set up, which we'll talk about next. However, clients will still get a confirmation email if they book online. If you're using the penciled in appointment status for online or in calendar bookings, this message is a great way to inform your clients that you have received their booking request. Head to Setup, followed by Customer Messages. Then click on Add a new message in the top right corner and select Appointment Penciled In from the list. Choose whether you'd like to send an SMS or email notification to your client and customize the SMS message if you choose that option. Just keep in mind that the email message cannot be customized. Once you're finished, click save and your message will be sent out whenever an appointment drops into the calendar with a penciled in status. No-shows suck. They're a killer for appointment-based businesses. When a customer fails to turn up for an appointment, you are faced with lost revenue and wasted time. But at least with Timely, you can enable an automated notification to be sent to the client when their booking is marked as a no-show. You have the option to set up an SMS or email reminder to let your customers know they missed their appointment and encourage them to book again. You can even customize the SMS message however you want. First, go to Setup, then Customer Messages in the main menu. Click Add New Message in the top right hand corner. Select the Did Not Show option from the list of messages. Next, select which notification type you'd like to send. You can set up both email and SMS notifications, but you'll need to set them up separately. If you're setting up an SMS notification, you will also be able to customize the message and use the dynamic placeholders on the left-hand side of your screen to insert into the message. At the moment, it isn't possible to customize the content of your did not show emails. If you find you're getting a lot of no-shows, putting a deposit or cancellation policy in place can be a really good idea. There's nothing like having to part with some money upfront to find out who your serious customers are.